For the CircuitPython Parsec today, I wanted to show you how you can play a WAV file on the Circuit Playground Express or the Circuit Playground Bluefruit inside of the Circuit Playground library, which gives us these really high level commands that are very consistent and easy to use. So in this case, you can see I've got a library I'm importing. That's the Adafruit Circuit Playground library, importing it as CP. Uh, and then the first thing I do is I play a WAV file with this simple command, cp.playfile, and then the name of a WAV file that's sitting on the flash storage of the device. So that's what happens when this starts up, and I'll demonstrate that in a second. Then, in the main loop of the program, I am checking for button presses and a switch to be thrown. So you can see here, if CP button A, that's the button on the left, gets pressed, then depending on the state of the little toggle switch, we play either this one file, BP box wave, or this other one, triode drama wave. And sir, uh, the B button always just plays this desk up dot wave. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to restart the board. I'm just going to press reset. And you can hear it did a little sort of Game Boy startup sound. And now I'm going to press the A button. I got a little file there called BB Box. Now I'm going to switch the switch to the right. And when I press the same button, I'm playing this other wave file. Triode Drama. And then the B button here always plays that one little bleepy file. And that is how you can play WAV files right on the Circuit Playground Express or Circuit Playground Bluefruit inside of CircuitPython using the Circuit Playground Library's play file command. And that is your CircuitPython Parsec.